All right, guys, welcome back to Baghdad Attack version two. And uh, you can see here, I just woke up and the worst has happened. Dude attacked in and took a double wheat and a double wood. Um, one thing we did notice early on is that the wood and the wheat are redundant. So uh, what I'm going to get out of this is a lot of iron and a couple woods and uh, and then one double wheat that I've already got. So not the worst thing ever, actually. Um, a lot of building resources here. Um, I think I can use this from now on to just be totally in the blue forever with my building materials. And that's good news. Um, build a lot of railways, so forth and so on, connect my empire. Um, what I'm doing now, um, this was not good news that he attacked in here. I really prefer to get all nine if I can. Um, I can see he's got an air force of eight bombers here and one bomber here. Um, however, my whoa 12 fighters should be able to take care of that if he wants to go to war with me what i'm doing now is i've split my bombers my 23 bombers into two cadres one is flying over to here attacking here the other is flying over here to attack and then 90 infantry each are moving in behind those bombers to take those i'm really trying to cut off uh british canada here from taking any more of these rings uh, once i've got these two he'll be essentially blocked although he can still uh, he can still reach around here and he can still reach around here, but uh, it'll be a lot more difficult for him to, to continue taking ring segments. So hoping to limit him to just two. Um, if I can get six of the outer eight and the interior one, that's still a really good um, capture. I love to have all of Baghdad because if you have all of Baghdad, that's really basically that's two regular oil fields worth. Now it's going to be more like what 1.5 oil fields worth. So not the best possible scenario. I would have had one oil field plus essentially two oil fields for a total of three, but really only two, you know, but, but in terms of power, um, I love sitting on Baghdad, uh, as the sole owner, um, again, from the very beginning, British Canada has been my chief, uh, enemy. You can see here, he's, he's quite a bit, uh, points up on me. I really wanted to get that, uh, that entire oil field, but <clears throat> If I can get, uh, gather all the rest of these outer rings, I think that'll be what I need to uh, counter him, to be equal in power to him. So I'll have one, two, three and a half, essentially. I've got, I forgot about this oil field down here. So I'll have three and a half oil fields. Um, that's about the best you can ask for, um, short of having four. So once I, once I finish this ring, I'm just really gonna start to build up uh, power and think about attacking down into here. Uh, that's Bulgaria. Bulgaria doesn't seem to have much uh, flex. British Canada will almost certainly attack into here at some point to get his third. Um, so it's going to be an interesting game, but really uh, we're here for Baghdad attacks. Just wanted to keep you posted. Uh, next video I'll post, I'll give you a final result. What finally happened? Was I able to get all five of these additional territories or not? So I'll see you when that happens, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Adios, amigos.